I just farted. Mm -hmm. What a mess. So today we're gonna be talking about how to give good fellatio. Now, I'm saying fellatio because I'm trying to come off like a little bit more sophisticated. I didn't wanna just come out and say, blow job. However, I did pick this topic when for the first like 20 years of my life, I thought a blow job was. <laughs> Are you done yet? But I am a well-known receiver of blowjobs, so look, I'm gonna try my best. So here's my advice on how to give good fellatio. Blowjobs. Mouths on penises. Okay, here we go. Get hydrated. Drink lots of water. Nobody likes a dry mouth. A dry tongue is no fun. Maybe you can do like a little bit of teeth, but not everybody likes teeth, so take it easy. If the guy starts to do like dirty talk, go along with it. Unless he says something creepy, then you need to get the hell out of there. And by creepy, I mean something like, like I wanna give you all my babies. You need to leave. Try different positions so you're not getting like a kink in your neck, you know what I'm talking about? No one likes to get a kink in their neck while they're working that mean penis. Try lying down on the bed, you know, get on your back, get on your front, show off the little booty, go up against the wall, go up against the fridge. If you're up against the fridge and you get a little hungry, then by all means, reach inside, get a little snack. If he says something along the lines of, well, like you have my dick, I'm gonna give you a snack. Again, this is something that's creepy and he needs to leave. Don't do that weird thing that I find a lot of straight guys do when they go to give like their first blowjob. They suddenly become like their like great grandmother. Don't let me suck your dick. Don't do that. Like, use your lips, use your tongue, but like, that's weird. When you start to taste fluids, pretend that you're enjoying it. Unless, you know, you're one of those really cool people who really like the taste of those fluids. I'm not one of those people, but I'm also not someone who's gonna suck a dick, so. <laughs> oh, and if he has like a turtleneck on his dick, use your tongue, go like in there, go inside there. Have some fun with that. And if he doesn't have a turtleneck, then I'm at a loss because I don't really know how those work. Sorry. Like, I don't get it. Like, aren't you cold? Where's your turtleneck? Where's the sweater? I don't understand. It's cold outside. Where's his turtleneck? Just get him his turtleneck! So I'm not gonna lie to you, that's basically all the advice I have to give on how to suck a mean dick. Maybe if my Canadian sexual education system did not fail me and all those poor girls in grade 12 who got pregnant. Ooh, and that one girl who got, like, crabs and then when she walked in the classroom, everyone started clapping. Yeah, that's all the advice I have. So if you like this video, please thumbs it up. Make sure you're subscribing. If you have any other tips on how to suck a mean dick, please comment in the comment section below. Be strong, be brave, and always remember to laugh a little. A dry tongue is no fun. It's like sandpaper on your dick.